Welcome to the instructional video on using package inserts. Keep in mind that package inserts are the most basic drug monographs that you're going to encounter. They're the things from the manufacturer that include all the basic information that they're essentially by law required to give to the consumer and to the health professionals. The information that's in here, though, it doesn't make it any less useful to you. The truth is, is that most of the time you're probably going to use a more user-friendly source of drug information, but there may come a time when this is all you have access to. If all you have, for whatever reason, is a package insert in front of you, you still should be able to find a vast amount of information because it's pretty much all contained in here. Once you actually unfold the thing, you'll find a number of different things. Some of them do want to point out that they actually have uh, essentially a patient handout that you may be able to, de to detach from the main portion of the package insert. But as far as information, you're going to find pretty much all the basic information that you would find in a standard drug monograph. The same things that you would find in, you know, print facts comparisons, drug information handbook, all those sorts of things. Of course, the PDR, which the PDR is at its heart, just a reproduction of these in book format. You're going to find a lot of information about clinical pharmacology, me mechanism of action, um, half-lives, things like that. It's all going to be in here. A variety of other things about indications, usages, contraindications, precautions, information about whether um, you need to adjust dosages for particularly renal or hepatic compromised patients, um, pediatric dosage, you know, geriatric dosage, pregnancy categories, all the basic information, your sort of go-to information should be able to be found in here. Of course, the problem is, is that they're just so dense. In some cases, it's very difficult to weed through these things and figure out the information that you really need out of them. They tend to have very, very small type. Um, from package insert to package insert, their organization may be different. Some of them may have a little, essentially, table of contents at the beginning, which is useful, but not all of them do. I just highly advise that people take a look at these, make sure you have some experience working with them, because in the end, you may have to at some point, and it's a good idea just to get practice scanning through these dense little documents to get the information that you need out of them. There's going to be a lot of other information in here. Remember, all kinds of information. You may see tables, you may see charts, all kinds of different stuff that's useful to you. And in the end, really the hardest part is getting it folded back into the way it came. Thanks for watching.